I'm Dr. Marwa, your medicine faculty at Preplatter, and I am super excited to introduce to you the man of the hour, Dr. Vicky Datta from Guwahati Medical College. Congratulations, doctor. Thank you, sir, so much. Uh, how does it feel at the moment? Very cliche question, but I am going to be asking that to everyone today. Yes, sir, it's very overwhelming, sir. I am very happy, sir. I couldn't believe, sir, that at last it happened, sir, finally. Okay, great. So, starting with the very, very first question, uh, how did you use rapid revision of prep ladder and how did it contribute to your growth? How did it contribute to this uh, final, I mean, uh, the, the final attainment of this uh, target? Yes, sir. So, uh, mainly I have used the rapid revision during my internship, sir, because the internship is very hectic in our college. So, to know the, what the things we have to study and focus on, so the rapid revision tells you the main important highlights the topic, sir. So by that way, sir, the rapid vision played a very vital role, sir, in my preparation. So I have watched almost all the videos on the rapid vision, then I have revised it at the end, sir. So How many times did you way, go through sir. the rapid revision, doctor? Sir? Pardon? How many times did you go through the rapid revision? Sir, around two to three times, sir. Oh, cool. That that must be very intensive. So how much time did it take you to complete the rapid revision the first time? Three to four months, sir. Around. Oh. Okay. So, any specific features of rapid revision that you would like to tell users that it is a must watch? Yes, sir. So, first of all, like the rapid revision, like the uh, gives you the main essence from the main re revision, main video, sir. They did highlights the important topics, the important like clues, which are the things we have to look for some diseases, which can be tested in the real exam. Like, it, like for someone who have very active internship like me. It will help to focus your energies on those important topics which are frequently getting tested in the examinations. So by that way, the rapid revision played an immense important concept. Yeah. yeah, we have tried to develop it in a fashion that every minute of that is power packed and is loaded with information that especially our intern when he is like tired at the end of the duty, but he gets that uh, stuff which is very interactive, very interesting, and at the same time high yield as well, which helps you get to the questions. So, what is that special feature of Preplatter app? That's your favorite. So, the Preplatter app tells us what the how is the level of preparation you are going on. Like it keeps a track on our activity. Like how much question bank you have done, how yeah. much test you have given, what is the current performance of your test, and also it helps to help compare ourselves with the others. Like all over India, how your level is going on. How like especially the INI. Mock examination, the need mock examination. You, you get to know that where you stand it today. If not exactly, it will depict the real exam, but you will know that where you stand and what is the level of preparation and what are the areas you have to focus on. So, by that way, preparator tell you that these are your weak areas and you have to focus on this much uh, stuff on this amount of time, then you can easily solve, easily solve any type of question. Uh, Doc, you would have given Preplatter Championship exam. How much did you yes. score? Uh, sir, uh, I got a rank of two, I guess. Oh, great, great, great. Awesome, awesome, perfect. And more importantly, like uh, when you went through the test, how would you rate it in comparison to the real scenario? I mean, was it uh, same level, more difficult? Sir, around a scale of 10, it would match around 8.5 to 9, sir. Okay, okay. And the level of difficulty and the level of questions sir. and comparison with the actual exam yes sir it almost depicted the real exam sir. the level of difficulties so for all those questions that went wrong how did you analyze them so actually uh, the questions which i went wrong either due to the lack of time uh, which i couldn't see them before. so during the mock exam also i saw that the, the topics which i am lacking behind i used to the Read, go to the main videos again, see, watch them. What are the things I am lacking behind that, those topics? So, by that way, the INI championship test also gave me an edge over others. Like, the, those topics which were tested in the real exam, also, I didn't get them wrong, which I got them wrong in the main INI, INI championship exam. So, this way, like, Pepe the help in many ways. Sir. So, suppose the questions went wrong. How would you, uh, like, you used to go through the explanation? So, how did you find the explanations of Pepe Ladder? Uh, are, they very so length, the are they very short? Are they precise? Your honest take on that? So the length is 
good enough, sir. Because to know the topic in depth, you should know that amount of length and details you have to know. Because INA don't te- test your superficial knowledge. It will go deep into the topics. Like this year also, every topics were common, but they went depth of each topic. Sir. So you have to know. So by that way, prep letter give you an authentic uh, explanation for from the standard books. True, true, true. So, favorite prep letter faculty? Sir, obviously you, sir. I have been following you since my second year. <laughs> so nice, so nice. Uh, favorite prep letter app feature? Sir, app feature, for me during internship, it was rapid division. <laughs> okay. And any favorite prep letter movement? I mean, anything that you can say that, okay, this made my day. Sir, the INA championship examination, which I uh, Gave, yes. where I got the rank of two, it boosted my confidence sir, before my real yes. exam. Yes, 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 yes. So I, was, I was guessing that actually. This would have been like really a super, super, uh, it would have superly boosted your confidence levels. Uh, okay, Doc, uh, any stressful days? Like how did you used to go about them? And uh, I mean, you know, uh, after all, we all tend to have bad days. So like uh, do share about yours. One month before the exam, any bad days that you had? Yes, sir. I, I had... Many bad days, not only one, because the internship is very hectic. I had burnout, sir. Because during the internship, I in the major posting, I couldn't even study 10 minutes also. So due to that stress, after the internship ended uh, on 14 April, so I had only around less than one month, I guess, around one month for my INI examination. So I thought like, I don't know anything about it. I don't know how to do it. But I stay, I hold on my nerves, like I stayed calm. I know, no, it's not. It's not made a base, it's made a repetition, it's made a repetition. Then, it's made a base, it's made a base, it's made a base, I have already done the base, so I have backed up, so I have to do it. I have to do it, I have to do it, I have to do it. That was my level of thought, sir. I mean, these are the golden words that you said, that you have to do it, I mean, that is the go-getter attitude. You are very crystal clear in your approach, and I really love that. I mean, uh, the words that you said, I think that's the positive vibes that we need to exude. Not uh, bordering on false confidence, but yeah, I mean, we, we need to be realistic, but at the same time, that jazba, right, that I have to do it, irrespective of whatever that comes as what is required. So uh, I know your inbox would be full with congratulatory messages, but what would be your messages to all the uh, neat aspirants, neat PG aspirants? Uh, how should they be going about, suppose their result in this exam may not be, you know, anticipated as what they wanted. Uh, it may not be that good. So, uh, uh, I mean, obviously I've been counseling them and I've been telling them to uh, keep the focus on, but yeah, your words would also matter a lot. So uh, please do guide the future NEET aspirants, the ones who are going to be preparing at the moment regarding how should they keep calm and uh, how should they go about planning their next four weeks. So first of all, those who couldn't clear this INA with their desired time, there is no need to worry. You have Within one month, you have the next big examination of your life. So, buckle up. Kuch jo hua, ek din stress hua, abhi ek do din mein, oh stress bhul jau. Mm-hmm. Because the competition is very huge. You have to get over the others. Like, you, you know that if you are not studying, someone else will be studying somewhere in the in the country. So, abhi duk manane ke ya shock manane ke koi samay nahi hai. And there is nothing called impossible. Because I have also faced so much of difficulty during my internship. So you, you also can do it. There is one month, you have handful of time, already you have revised, not uh, if the full course, at least half also you have revised before the INA exam. So you have time, plenty of time. Study your notes or the chota copy or whatever you have made for the revision. Just stay focused. That's the most important. And always think positive. Like, obviously, there is nothing called impossible in this planet sir everything is possible just your hard work dedication and perseverance is important so this much i want to say all the future need experience any advice to these aspirants ke prep letter custom modules kaise use kare uh, any tips any suggestions kya filters lagayein ki they are able to get to those high yield questions uh, jo topics frequently aate hain so any suggestions for the same the, the custom modules like you have to use like properly like not you can't just put this random subject tag. You have to very be very specific because the exam is near. So just give the previous year topics. Difficulty for need you can set moderate or sometimes maybe hard also because 
the moderate is usual level of difficulty in the exam then the frequently mistaken topics or the bookmark questions which you are because abhi jo strong hai us pe focus karne ka kuch fayda nahi hai jo aapka weak hai us pe aap improve karne hai taaki aapka rank improve ho sake so right. this type of tag you should give in the custom modules so aapka suggestion hai ki weak subjects ko focus kare rather than strong wale ko aur strong banane ki jagah pe yes sir okay okay तो मतलब मिनिमम कितने क्वेश्चंस रोज करने चाहिए आई मीन हाउ मेनी वर यू डूइंग लाइक वन मंथ बिफोर द एग्जाम सर मिनिमम 50 टू 100 सर रेगुलरली दैट इज एक या दो कस्टम मॉड्यूल ऑफ 50 ईच करने चाहिए सर बिकॉज़ इफ यू सिलेक्ट मल्टीपल फिल्टर्स नाउ उसका भी फायदा नहीं होता है सो आई थिंक डॉक्टर विकिल इज राइट इन दैट कि बहुत ज्यादा भी करने का फायदा नहीं है बट हां पीवाईटी वाले पीवाईक्यूज वाले टॉपिक्स पे आप uh try to use the preplatter app very optimally and it's it's designed in such a fashion that it will give you a idea of like how are you preparing you know it would it would keep on prompting you that if you are putting less number of hours then it's like a more of a ai kind of a system that helps you know that okay fine i'm not studying well on this particular day so you'll get a prompt that just pops you up and you're going to say okay man i'm going to go and uh go ahead and put in my best efforts so jo ho gaya yaar wo ho gaya but i think that uh Uh, Dr. Vicky said the right thing. I mean, those words, you know, that vision is what is basically required. If we have to do it, then nothing is going to be stopping. Irrespective of how hectic the internship postings are, we still have to push ourselves and go to the final goal. So, any dedications, Dr. Vicky Dutta? Sir, okay. Sir, any first speech? of all, I will. Yeah, yeah. Dedications. Okay. Sir, first of all, I would like to dedicate my this rank and my performance to my mom and my parents. first of all they were the only one who always saw me the level of hard work i have put daily they were always cheering me up even in my bad days like koi to hona chahiye back me jo aapko push kar sake always give me like positive vibe nahi aap tumse hoga kyun nahi hoga tum itna padha hai acche se obviously they are the first secondly they all my teachers sir first of all i want to give full to i as a name nahi le sakte but almost all the teachers from all I, I, from right from my college days everyone helped me sir and my seniors also pgt seniors who helped me to learn different skills during internship sabne mehnat kiya sabka mehnat ka ye phal hai not only single i can't name like single person right right so doc it's been great great talking to you and uh, welcome uh, to that uh, level where you have achieved your goals obviously there are a lot of other laurels to be still won lot of uh victories to be won but yes this is one that you you can cherish and smile and relax about today so aaj to i think party hogi ghar pe yes <laughs> yes <laughs> okay okay so a great doctor thank you so much for uh, sharing your journey with us and preplatter wishes you a great great career ahead and uh, uh, thanks for being the part of the preplatter family for so many years you've been with us so great to see you having a great great and a bright view of your future ahead so preplatter is there to support you every one of you who's listening to this uh, even if you have not attained optimal results i would say that uh, this young doctor i mean i obviously you keep on listening to me but the few words he he is he's a man of very few words dr vicky but in those wo kaun words mein na he has said a very very i would say pertinent very potent statements which if you can go back in the video listen to what he has said very crystal clear very focused and that is what is required for the next four weeks uh, give it your best shot sleep as less as possible uh, obviously i mean not not to focus too much on sleep deprivation but yeah i mean that sacrifice is this only that jo dr vicky ne bola ki if you are not studying there is somebody else in the country who is logging in some library who is logging in his hostel room at that point of time and he is going to learn those points he is going to learn those uh, information because it's a cutthroat competition out there uh, not that competition is bad competition can be taken in a healthy spirit as well so we will say that a balanced approach is what is required we don't need to be too overwhelmed by uh, you know, so much of data that is coming to us but at the same time we need to be very crystal clear with respect to what i'm going to do in this hour the next hour and the next hour a uh, micro planning kariye and you are going to do great in your careers uh, dr vicky any bites you would like to add to this uh, sir once again i would like to thank the team pepper sir for always helping me sir and without them it wouldn't have been possible sir so i would like to thank the team once again sir 
Thank you, Dr. Vicky. Thank you. Thank you for your time and uh, God bless you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Thank you. Thank you.